Hi, I'm Danny Agnew, New York editor of Inside Hook, and I'm here to talk to you about what clothes a guy should own. Now, I could talk to you for days about what clothes I think a guy should own. We could get into double-breasted blazers and tasseled loafers, but that's sort of complicated. For now, I'm just going to walk you through a few key pieces that every guy should have in his wardrobe, stuff that's really versatile and you can mix up in a lot of different ways. First item we're going to talk about, and this is a must for every man's wardrobe, is a white Oxford shirt. You can wear it crisp and pressed with a nice suit, or if it's wrinkled and rumpled, you can pull it out of your bag, throw it on with a pair of shorts at the beach. It's a great look, super versatile. Whenever it's dirty, you just throw it in the wash, bleach it out, and when the collar starts to get a little yellow, you know it's time to buy a new one. Next, you've got your gray crew neck sweatshirt. Again, super versatile. You can wear this with just about anything. You can throw it on with a pair of shorts if it's a little chilly out, or you can put it underneath a blazer if you're going out on the town. Basically, this is something that just goes with a lot of stuff. You can put it on over a nice Oxford shirt and functions as a sweater. Basically, just a very clutch go-to thing. Additionally, if you're going to the gym, never hurt. Next, the old American standby, the white t-shirt. Now, I know what you're thinking. You say, oh my god, I have 100 white t-shirts. I wear them as undershirts. I'm not talking about an undershirt. You need something clean, crisp, with a pocket so people don't think that you're walking around in your undershirt. And again, it goes with everything. Leather jacket, denim jacket, super versatile, great thing to have in your closet. Speaking of leather jackets, every guy should have one. You can do black, like this one from All Saints, or brown, like this one from Rogue. Doesn't matter. Totally a matter of preference. But basically, this is your instant dose of cool. Throw it on over top of any casual outfit, and basically, you look immediately put together and very cool, and that's awesome. Next, you've got your classic navy blazer. Now, this has been a staple of the American man's wardrobe for longer than most people can remember. And it's a great thing because navy is your all-time most versatile color. Literally goes with just about everything. You can throw it on, you can dress it up, you can dress it down, you can wear it with a t-shirt, you can wear it with an Oxford, and it's going to look good. Nice, you know, straight ahead navy blazer is something every guy should have. The second blazer every man should have is a tweed herringbone, a gray tweed herringbone. You can dress it up and wear it with a shirt and tie, goes great with jeans. This is going to be your other most versatile jacket, especially in those chillier fall and winter months. Speaking of jackets, pocket squares. Pocket squares are never anything you should just go out searching for. Eventually you're going to run across them, you'll see a nice piece of fabric, grab it, and it'll work great. You stuff it in there, it's a no-brainer, it's something that's really easy, and it's a great way to punch up an outfit. Seriously, this pocket square here was a catering napkin. Looks awesome. Next thing you're going to want to have, a couple of go-to pairs of jeans. This is going to be your everyday stuff. You throw it on with everything. General staple of a man's wardrobe. You're going to want something sort of in a lighter wash, you know, maybe a little bit washed out, like these. Also, you're going to want something a little darker. This is more of an evening jean. You know, something that's a little more raw, a little more crisp. Also, try and have like a dark, dark jean. Something like a black goes better with your black leather jackets, that sort of thing. And in addition to the jeans, you're going to want to have at least one chino that's in a crazy color. This is going to be what's called a GTH pant. That stands for go to, you figure out the rest of it. Basically, this is the pant that you wear to make a statement and you, know, you sort of build your outfit around it. And it's kind of a cool, fun thing to do and it's a great way to spice up your wardrobe. Speaking of denim, every guy should own one denim jacket. Again, you could sort of wear this with anything and I know that's sort of a recurring theme for the stuff that we're talking about because it's all about versatility and what can you combine in interesting ways without spending a ton of money. Denim jacket's great, Levi's makes the best one, slim fit, it's awesome. If you don't want to go all the way for the denim jacket, at the very least, do yourself up a denim shirt, classic Americana, total workwear, great casual look, and additionally it makes you look tough and chicks love a tough guy. Now eventually you're going to need to put something on your feet. First off, classic black boot, classic boot of any kind really. It can be brown, it can be black, just get yourself one boot. It's great for the colder months and it's something that goes with a lot of casual looks and you're going to want to have that in your closet. Similarly, get yourself a wingtip. You can dress it up, you can dress it down, complements a lot of stuff, and it's a total head turner. It's one of those things that people are going to notice. Next up, you've got your classic flannel shirt. Just make sure when you buy it, it fits slim and trim like your other dress shirts. The last thing you want is to look like Paul Bunyan, but this is great. You can wear it on its own and roll the sleeves up. You can throw your denim jacket over top of it. It's going to be a good look regardless. Similar to a pocket square, nice little detail is a silver tie clip. There's all kinds of great vintage ones you can find online. Basically, this is a surefire way to get your tie noticed. You've been wearing ties for years, nobody ever said anything. Put a tie clip on and watch how many people compliment you on it. Another key thing every guy should own, raincoat. This jacket from Barber is a classic. It will last you for the rest of your life. 
and as you can see, fits in a way and looks great enough that you can wear it in even some more elegant situations. Which brings me to, last but not least, thing every guy should own, the classic one button tuxedo. Now, I know what you're saying, how often do I ever need to wear a tuxedo? If I need a tuxedo, I'll go rent one. I'm here to tell you that rental tuxedos are the devil. You never want to have one, they look terrible, they fit terrible, and nobody will ever remember you. You get a nice classic tuxedo, this one's from Calvin Klein. You pair it with a crisp white dress shirt, something with a placket over the buttons, keep it clean, keep it simple. You've got a look that is guaranteed to turn some heads and let you steal the show at weddings, formal events, whatever. Once again, I'm Danny Agnew, New York editor of Inside Hook, and this has been at least some of the clothes that a guy should own.